Layla, come here. No, wait, wait, wait! Stop! The scenes are heart-stopping. Vehicles narrowly missing children. Now, 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 now. Speeding by school buses with a stop arm out and lights flashing. This car nearly hitting two children waiting for the bus in Indiana earlier this year. And as more school districts begin classes across the country, a company called Bus Patrol is using AI-powered cameras on more than 40,000 buses in 22 states to catch vehicle violations. The Lower Marion School District outside Philadelphia is using the cameras this school year. That stop sign comes out. Those cameras start recording. All 135 school buses in their fleet now outfitted with the cameras. We're hoping we see no violations because that would be safest for kids, but realistically, our expectation is we're going to start seeing a lot of them then. They took us on a routine bus route to demonstrate how it works. Terry Robinson has been driving a school bus for 21 years. Terry, how often are you seeing people just drive by with that stop sign out? Multiple times every day. And in just 30 minutes, we saw several possible violations. Okay, so we have the stop sign out. This car ignoring the stop arm as it makes a turn past the bus. That car that turned should have stopped. So even across the street, he, they should have stopped. Everything stops. And multiple cars going past the bus on the other side of the road, failing to stop despite the flashing lights and visible stop sign. Oh, we got a bunch of cars. According to police, once a violation is identified on the camera, the company flags it to the local police department for review. And if they issue a ticket, it's a hefty fine, $300 in Pennsylvania for a first time violation. This system allows us to be at every stop for every school bus. So it's really going to effectively increase how we can enforce these violations. In the nearby Marple Newtown School District, police say they ticketed more than 2,000 drivers ignoring the stop arm since that school district installed the bus patrol cameras at the beginning of the 2024 school year. And the Lower Marion School District is hoping it'll make a difference here. It's just not worth the chance of hurting a child and having to deal with that pain for the rest of your life. And I got to tell you, just looking at these school buses, they don't look any different than any other school bus. So you really wouldn't know which ones have the cameras and which don't. So just follow the law. When you see a stopped bus, actually stop. Let those kids board and get off safely there. And it's only going to take some 20 to 30 seconds for that school bus to move. So just relax a little bit to keep these kids safe. Gio Benitez, ABC News, Narbeth, Pennsylvania.